Lawmakers demanding answers after a massive coal ash spill in East Tennessee more than a decade ago. We have been covering the coal ash spill in Kingston since it happened back in 2008. Now, coal ash gushing into the Emory River and onto surrounding homes and properties there. A lawsuit filed by the workers of the cleanup under Jacobs Engineering claiming that workers were not protected. Congressman Tim Burchett citing a Knoxville News Sentinel article in saying Jacobs Engineering admitted lying to workers. He and Congressman Steve Cohen, a Democrat, writing a letter to TVA President William Johnson. We do have a copy of that letter, the letter looking for seven specific answers into different angles of cleanup work, including worker complaints dating back to 2013 and TVA's reasoning for hiring Jacobs Engineering in the first place. Now, Burchett and Cohen say it is TVA's mission to improve the quality of life in the Valley. They suggest the authority is not doing that for the hundreds of workers who are either sick or who have died. No word tonight on any response from TVA or its president. Of course, we will keep you updated.